Hey guys, how you doing? I just want to quick talk quickly about Aaron. Oh yeah, I hope I'm saying that name right. I'm probably not. I'm probably not. It's not even a difficult name to say. I'm going to say Aaron Dohi. I'm going to say that. He's great. I follow him a lot on YouTube. He talks a lot about law of attraction, about bringing things into your life, about making stuff happen. But he's just, his story is amazing. He was a shoe salesman in, I don't know where, America somewhere. You may, I'm going to say New York, probably not New York. And he decided, he made an intention that he was going to become a YouTuber and make a YouTube video every day. And I don't know if, if any of you guys have ever put anything on YouTube, but, or even a bit shoot or just out there into the internet, blogging, social media, whatever. There is a point, there's a point to start, this is the activation energy that, energy that I was talking about before. At first, you get zero attention. You are doing videos for yourself, mostly just for yourself and a few people who know you, which you could just call around to them and have a chat with them if you wanted to. <laughs> That's the way it begins. And through dedication and over time, and through being consistent, it grows. But it grows out of nowhere. And you don't know when it's going to start growing. And it's like when you put a seed in the ground. And you don't know if that seed is ever going to grow. But you have to put it in the ground and trust that it knows what to do. And you could be sitting there three months. You could be watering it and watching it. And you don't know if it's ever going to grow, but suddenly it just spreads up out of the ground and starts growing. But there's a real difficult point where you don't know what, if anything is happening. You're wasting your time. So he posted a YouTube video every day and he's now a very, very well-known YouTuber. He's making his living from YouTube, probably a pretty good living from online. Let's not say YouTube, because I'm sure there's lots of places he is, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, BitChute, whatever. There's lots of places he is, but he's making a pretty good living from that now. But he had to trust, he had to trust, he had to trust that this shoe salesman could make his living in another way. And he had to entrust that intention that he put out, that intention that he put out that I'm going to have freedom. I'm going to create freedom in my world. And he didn't do all the courses, he didn't do the, all of the, are you sick of your nine to five? Take my course. Again, nothing wrong with taking the courses. Not wrong with taking the courses. But he didn't do that. He put the intention out of the universe. He trusted. Probably has more trust than me, by the way. He trusted. And he received after a good amount of time. It took some time. But eventually he received. And during that time, he was learning. So learning how to write titles, how to do good videos, how to do everything else. So he was learning all that at the time. But he trusts it. And he gives amazing, amazing, amazing information now. He's very into a lot of spiritual teachers, one particularly one Bashar. And he puts amazing information out there. And he could be a, still a shoe salesman right now. And I'm sure he'd be paying his bills and he'd be okay. Maybe he wouldn't be the happiest guy in the world. But he would be living, he would be able to pay his bills. And he would help people find good shoes, which there is some pride in that, being able to find good shoes for people. But of course, the lockdown would have killed them. No one's going out and trying shoes on during the lockdown. Lockdown would have completely killed them. So maybe he has some sort of premonition about, hey, I need to change what I'm doing. And he did it a number of years ago before lockdown happened. But the corona lockdown would have just killed them, obviously. He wouldn't still be working. And he was on my under my understanding, commission only. So on a commission only, you're not going to be making much money in lockdown. But he went for what he wanted to do. And sometimes you can't do this. If you have a family and a mortgage and everything else, and you have a lot of bills, sometimes you just can't do that. You have to pay your bills. But a lot of people can. A lot of people can. So I want you to check out Aaron Dohi. 
apologies for saying the name wrong. I, should, I think I'm probably saying the name wrong, so apologies for that. But incredible information. I'm going to link into them. And um, incredible information. I'm going to probably link out to his Instagram and his YouTube. But take a look at Aaron Dowie and listen to his story. I'll see if I can find the exact video with his story and link out to us. This has been Alan here from Look Up of Warrior. Subscribe to the channel. <laughs> We're going to connect you with some incredible, incredible people, incredible YouTubers. And put a comment in here. Do you know Aaron Dowie? Do you, have, you, have you listened to his videos? Put a comment in down here. What's your opinion?